Flipside is a collection of 12 original artworks by James Castle paired with 12 facsimiles, allowing both sides of each piece to be viewed simultaneously. This complete view of each work allows us insight into the inventive tools and techniques Castle was so adept with, the daily living habits of the family that cared for him throughout his life, and the changes in material culture seen over the course of decades. This piece is one of Castle's drawings that feature a grid structure, which was likely influenced by his love of calendars. Castle was known to collect calendars and recreated this layout many times, filling the boxes with patterns or images rather than numbers. The imagery in this grid is challenging to recognize because its orientation is perpendicular to the rest of the piece. By reimagining the orientation, you can discern two panels from a comic-style scene with figures speaking to each other in voice bubbles. The figure to the left of the grid is of unknown origin, but it is one that appears repeatedly in Castle's grid works, each time with variations to the form of the figure or the medallion shapes surrounding it. The back of this work reveals a doctor's bill from 1956 for Castle's brother-in-law, Guy Wade. Guy married Castle's younger sister, Peggy, in 1928, and was a large part of Castle's daily life. Guy and Peggy moved into the Eugene Street house with James and his mother Mary, and they took over care of the property after Mary passed away in 1948. Castle continued to live with Peggy, Guy, and their four children throughout the rest of his life. The Eastman Building, where the doctor's office was located, was in downtown Boise at the corner of 8th and Main Street. This iconic structure was built in 1905 and housed doctors and dentists' offices throughout much of its history. The building burned down in 1987, and the lot was later filled by the Zions Bank building. Route number 3, Box 97, was the original mailing address to the Castle family home when rural delivery service was a standard for the area. The street name Castle Drive started to be used in the 1940s, and was used interchangeably with Route No. 3 until the late 1950s, when the name change became permanent. The original front door of the Castle family home faced north toward the street that is now called Castle Drive. As the family added on to the home, the front door was moved to face Eugene Street.